And I've said this, you know, plenty of times. The greatest footy story our game's ever seen. Oh. Irish kid, never played, comes across, wins a brown line. I was probably addicted to anything exciting. Then I took on the role as president of the Melbourne Footy Club. So I was getting a bit concerned and it was probably a bit, a bit too much of the ego. Well, Demon President Jimmy Stein, it's good to have you with us, Jim. Since assuming control of the presidency last year, Jim Stein has re-energised the Demons. Today, though, that energy was replaced with raw emotion. Yeah. Try and get through this in one piece. I heard in the initial diagnosis, which was... Jim, you've got cancer in a number of places in your body. This neurosurgeon went and tested me, and he said, um, look, we've got to get you in and get another scan. And yeah, apparently on your, the scan you had yesterday, there's a new one that's oh, close to... Serious? Yeah, little one that's a little bit like this too. There's one there and there's one there. Uh, he's had three massive tomazepam tablets, 10 milligrams each. I want to see your eyes. <laughs> The soccer ball. Just throw the ball. Oh, that didn't work, did it? No one inside, no alibi. We fade in faster than the speed light. Because I've often said to him, you just can't leave me here on my own to do this. Because he was always, you know, he's the one there at the end of the day when I'm a mess and. You know who's at home watching this game sitting up in his bed? Jimmy Stein's watching. What is what mess is what mess is you get up sitting in this last quarter? When faced with death, the ego just drops its barriers. I needed to live a better life and getting cancer has led me to a much better life. <laughs>